Right now on the TV is playing Dish Network. So in order to switch it to Roku, uh, we just have to take it off of the Dish Network setting. So right now the, the you wanna make sure when you're operating the remote for the Dish Network, it's selected satellite, okay? So you would just, if, and if you wanna double check that, you can just click the satellite button and then you'll be able to do anything you want here on the remote. You'll be able to open up the guide um, and operate it that way, okay? So I'm gonna click back and then to switch it over to Roku, which is a better streaming option for, uh, you know, as a smart TV for Netflix, Hulu, those, kind, those kinds of things. You're just gonna click the TV button here on the side and then it switches the remote over to be able to control the input of the TV and you'll see a notification of that on the TV itself. And now that you have the TV button selected, you're gonna click input and that is your selector at the top. I'm gonna zoom in so you can see. And if you, I actually waited too long there because it selected comp network at the top or the comp input. I'm gonna keep going down and the selection you want to click is game. So I just let go right there. And now I'm on Roku and I can operate that using the Roku remote. And then to go back, uh, you would take the Dish Network uh, remote again and you would choose input. And up at the top, you're gonna go to uh, HDMI 4. And then you just, so you just click it and then wait and wait a second and then it'll automatically select it. And then you'll see that notification there that says you got to click set to, to operate the TV. And so that's where you click the set button and I'll see, I'll show you what it does there. Automatically go away and then you'll be able to operate this as normal again. Thanks.